Ah, commercials. The reasons we buy things, use DVRs, and feel like Flo from Progressive is our high school best friend. She was definitely the kid whose parents let you party in the basement. What's up guys, I'm Melissa Salvatore for 8012. For a relatively young form of media, the commercials really changed a lot in less than 100 years. Sure, advertising has been around since the ancient Egyptians, but the commercial wouldn't challenge print advertising as the main way to sell something until the 1920s. Not so coincidentally, 1920 being the first commercial radio broadcast aired in America. What's acknowledged as the first paid radio spot aired on New York City's WEAF on August 28, 1922. A developer spent 10 minutes talking about new apartments for rent in Queens. And you think 30 seconds of the 1877 cards for kids jingle is annoying. The next step for radio commercials were advertisers sponsoring a whole show, like the Jell-O program starring Jack Benny. Realizing you could make more money selling out multiple commercial breaks, broadcast radio evolved quickly to what we have today. A lot of quick spots and live reads throughout the hour. TV got started a little later. Its first ad came in 1941, when Bulova Watches paid nine bucks to air this spot before a Dodgers-Phillies game. Like radio, TV would experiment with full program sponsors like Texaco Star Theater, before eventually settling into the 30 second format we grew up with. Total ad time has grown though. You'd see nine minutes of ads per hour in the 60s. Today, an hour long show is really only 42 minutes with double the ad time, forcing us millennial cord cutters and DVR users to put the traditional commercial on the ropes. Leading advertisers then to product placement, pre-roll ads, or those awkward interruptions when your party playlist is jumping, but you didn't spring for Spotify premium. At least our Hulu countdown clocks aren't 10 minutes long. We still don't know where the beef is from 8012. Thanks for watching 8012. Make sure to subscribe, leave a comment, and like our videos. No, you have to tap like. You can't swipe right on me.